What up, what up, what up, y'all? It's your boy, Moan T. And it's time for that five-minute cigar review. Uh, today's weather is mm, iffy. It looks cloudy like it might rain. Uh, report says it's not going to rain. Not sure. But, yeah, there you go. Today's special guest. Let's get into that. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to leave your comments. And don't forget to share this video with your peoples and enemies and friends and everyone who may or may not want to watch me, Moan T, give a five-minute cigar review on the H. Upman by A.J. Fernandez. The H. Upman by A.J. Fernandez. This was recommended to me by a buddy of mine over at the uh, Smoker Friendly in Aurora, Colorado, off of Yale and Parker. A little plug for you guys over there. Uh, Orlando recommended this. Now, Orlando's been smoking cigars long uh, before I have, and I trust his judgment on a lot of recommendations. He's recommended a lot of good stuff. This one is, uh, eh. Orlando, if you watch this, baby, you know I love you. This one, eh. It's not bad, it's not good. I'm give it three fingers. Um, H. Upman, uh, Again, those are one, uh, another brand of cigars where I like some, don't like others. And this one is right in the middle. Three fingers. It's kind of bitter. Uh, reading up on it after I smoked the first one, it said it's got cocoa and spices and stuff. It's a little spicy. Um, not overly spicy. But a little spicy. But pretty bitter. And not like the coffee or cocoa bitter. It's just bitter. It reminds me of... Of... of uh, collard greens without the good flavor of some pork or some turkey in there. It's just the bitterness of collard greens. And I love collard greens, but it's got to have a little saltiness to it to diffuse some of that bitterness. This doesn't have that. It's got the spice, but no, not even an, <coughs> excuse me, not even an earthiness or a, you know, anything salty at all. No leather, no nothing to help diffuse some of the bitter. It's just bitter and spice to me. But again, it's not a bad cigar. The construction is really good. Before I forget, let me check out what we got in it. Um, according to my uh, sources, the wrapper is an Ecuadorian with Sumatran seed. And the binder is Nicaraguan. And the filler is Dominican and Nicaraguan. So, as most cigars today, a good uh, mm, blend of tobaccos from that region where we get all our tobaccos uh so i don't know why this one is so bitter to me and i smoked one uh, yesterday and noticed that bitterness and i thought wow maybe there's something wrong with me maybe maybe i was eating something or whatever but today didn't eat anything out of the ordinary i've been drinking mainly water and it's still got a pretty strong bitterness to me it, bitterness in a cigar is not necessarily a bad thing um again depending on the type of bitter it is you know, you put bitters sometimes in your drink to enhance the flavor of a good drink, a good cocktail. Uh, I, for one, like a good uh, <coughs> old-fashioned, and you put a little bitters in there, and it enhances that. This one, it, it's not good or bad. It's it, Like I said, it reminds me of collard greens. Maybe actually, maybe more like spinach greens, or mustard greens. I'm sorry, mustard greens. It's got more of a mustard green bitterness to it. Um, but not bad, just noticeable. That's probably the best way I can say it. It's noticeably bitter and with a little hint of spice in there. Can't really... No, I can't really pin down the spicy. Um, I've been trying to get better at determining between black pepper, red pepper, white pepper, cayenne, you know, cinnamon, all those different things. Um, if I had to take a guess, I'd say maybe sort of a reddish red pepper but not really sure but again good construction good build easy on the draw a little bit and i mean a very little bit loose on the draw but not anywhere near loose enough to where it's distracting or you know you feel like it's you're just sucking in air um but it is a little bit loose on the draw burns uh, this one last the one i had yesterday burned i thought a little fast this one is burning a little bit slower maybe uh I'm a little bit more relaxed, I don't know, but um, not, 
I really don't have any complaints on the cigar and the construction and all that. Just again, it's noticeably bitter. That's probably the only thing I got to say uh, really bad about it. But because of that, uh, again, only three fingers. So there you have it, y'all. Y'all go have a great day. Enjoy your time, whatever. Um, stay smoky, be cool, all of that jazz. And you know, peace out.